Hi folks, welcome to Cloud Academy's learning path for the Microsoft Azure 70-532 certification exam. I'm Josh Lane, Cloud Academy's Azure content lead and your guide through a brief tour of this updated learning path. This path is a curated guide through the topics covered on the 70-532 Developing Microsoft Azure Solutions certification exam and is meant to help you prepare to sit the exam. Now bear in mind though that you're likely to fare much better on the exam if you have real world experience with the technologies covered here rather than attempting to pass from study alone. Plan to spend time building software that runs in Azure and using the services exposed by the platform to maximize your chances for a good exam score. More specifically, this course will provide a broad overview of the following major exam topics. Azure Virtual Machines and related concepts like VM Attached Storage and Virtual Networks. Azure Data Storage options like Queues, Blobs, Tables, SQL Database, Cosmos DB, also known as or formerly known as Document DB, and the Redis Cache service. Hybrid connectivity features like ExpressRoute and VPN Gateway. Azure Active Directory, including B2C and B2B options, as well as application integration scenarios. Secure reliable messaging with Azure Service Bus. Platform as a service options like Azure App Service and serverless computing with Azure Functions. And finally, building reliable, scalable microservices with Azure Service Fabric. Here are the main objectives for this learning path. First, understand the 70-532 exam format, the target audience, and the major topic areas as outlined by the Microsoft certification site. Next, review each major exam topic and understand the detailed coverage areas likely to appear on the exam. We'll build a reference list of additional in-depth material to help fill in your particular knowledge gaps. And finally, we'll help you gain tips and tricks for sitting the exam and achieving a passing score. Here's a quick look at the various Microsoft certification paths in existence at the time of this recording. Note again that the 70-532 exam can count toward both the Certified Solution Associate and Certified Solution Expert tracks, since the MCSA certification is a prerequisite of the MCSE. One final note, the Azure Cloud and Associated Services change regularly to reflect new capabilities and eliminate outdated ones and the associated certification exams naturally follow the same model. So longtime Cloud Academy subscribers will recognize that we've had a version of this learning path for prior iterations of the exam. This new version of the learning path reflects the most up-to-date content on the exam as of spring 2017. Okay, so are you ready to get started? Then let's go.